the three, the big three, as we call them, uh, all down the middle today. Do you think that's uh, how you're going to deploy them tomorrow? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think uh, they they got an opportunity to make other people around them better. We uh, we like the way some of the guys are playing. Luchik is is uh, played very well since he's come back. So we want to take advantage of that, but. Strength-wise, when you don't have the matchup and you don't get the match on the road, you, we're going to have to get other people participating. So we like what we see, especially when we looked at it at practice today. Players and you talked about the, the energy level, you know, some excitement about the playoff chase, chance to get to four within four after the New Jersey game, and it, it didn't work out. Arizona won last night. What, what was your sense? I, of the I don't look level? at it like I, we, we know what we've got to do. There's little segments, and we know we've got to win two or three on the road here. I look at it like that. We win two or three in the road, then we've got to look at winning a lot at home. But we got to get back home still in the race, and s s still in the race is single digits. And if if you're double digits when you get back home, you know it's uh, going to be really tough. Then you pretty much got to win out like nine in a row or something. So I, all I look at it is these are three opponents above us in the standings. A couple of them, one is stumbling a little bit, and we got to take advantage of it. But to me, the bigger picture is the last game. It, we, we played awful well. We kept our goals against, our chances against down, and then we, we elevated it. We gave up too many quality scoring chances, uh, and that, that doesn't augment well. And that, that's the part that was upsetting. We had really turned the corner. I think we had a goals against average of, of just over two, and uh, our scoring chances were way, way down, and then we, we kind of blew it up in the last game. Why is Arizona getting things done with so many injuries? Well, I think the two things. The goaltender's excellent, and they've got an experienced group of defensemen, and that's how you win in the National Hockey League. When you've got a goaltender who's standing on his head carrying a save percentage of 1.5, and you've got those experienced competitive defensemen like they do, those five guys, you can win a lot of games. And what does Milan have to do with Connor? Just keep pushing the puck in front of him. As long as the puck stays in front of him, he's going to open up space. And for whatever reason, he seemed as as when he plays with a center who plays with tempo, he plays with tempo. And he's played with good players before. Let's give him the chance. He's he's done a lot of things. You sure, as a coach and as a teammate, would love on a team. He does a lot of the heavy lifting. So let's give him this opportunity. You plan on Koskinen starting both games? I got Koski going tomorrow, and then we'll see. You talked about how much you liked the way your bottom pair played last game. Is there any thought to maybe giving them a little bit more responsibility in your minutes uh, coming up here? Well, on paper, you like to do that. And then on the paper drive usually gets you in a lot of trouble. So we'll just see. Um, I like the way they played. But I know when you hit a wall minutes-wise, when you get too high up the ladder, then you, you run into tough situations. Quite frankly, we need that top four. We needed them to get back to where they were before. They were really doing a good job at keeping it out of our net, defending well. We need them to get back to that so that we, we can afford to balance out our pairs a little bit better. Okay.